Okay, uh, this question is for uh, Rick James. So I uh, will try to answer uh, Rick James' question. So it says here, uh, Milrinone has been ordered for a patient at 50 mx per kilogram over 10 minutes, followed by a continuous infusion of 0.5 mics per kilogram per minute. The pharmacy stocks premix bags of Milrinone containing 0.2 mg uh, ml. What is the continuous rate of infusion? So, the one that we're going to answer here is what the question is asking us. What is the continuous rate of infusion? This is pertaining to ml per hour. And what do you mean by that? So, it means that we're going to focus on here. Continuous infusion of 0 0.5 mics per kilogram per minute. Okay? And we're going to use this one too. The one that is given here. What is the continuous rate of infusion? So, um, remember when we're uh, doing the uh, my, my equation, I'm just going to make a big uh, divider here, a line that divides between the two where we're going to uh, cancel um, all of our variables. So, uh, ml per hour. Uh, 0 0.2 milligrams per ml okay. so uh, 0 0.2 milligrams per ml what are we gonna do there so uh, first and foremost we're going to divide this into one two and then three and four okay and um, we're going to put our ml here ml for, for this one and then uh, 0 0.2 milligram we're gonna put it here so it's 0 0.2 milligram okay just like before when we were doing when we were answering our problem and then um, what else so our mics per kilogram per minute we're going to put it here mics per kilogram Per minute, okay. So, uh, how many mics are we uh, going to run here? It says here 0 0.5, okay, 0 0.5 mics per kit. Okay. So, what is the kilogram? Uh, how many kilos uh, the patient weight? So, we don't know. So, uh, let's just uh, say that the patient weights 198 pounds. And um, one kilogram is equivalent to okay, one kilogram is equivalent to how many pounds? Two point two pounds, right? Okay. And um, if we're looking for uh, mLs per hour, okay, how are we going to solve this then? So uh, minutes, uh, one hour is equivalent to how many minutes? 60 minutes, right? 60 minutes. So, uh, after we work everything here, we're gonna work on this side, on the bottom. So, uh, it's 0 0.2 milligram, okay? So, uh, we cannot pursue our computation because this one is in microgram. Right. So what we're going to do is we convert this 0 0.2 milligram to microgram. So one milligram is equivalent to how many microgram? One thousand microgram. Right. So uh, and then we're going to uh, begin our computation now. Okay, I think we're good. So, uh, probably we, we cancel our variables first. Okay, so uh, pounds, cancel pounds, pounds. Okay, and then uh, 198 divided by 2.2, this is equivalent to 90 kilograms. Okay. 
cancel kilogram kilogram and then uh, cancel uh, minute and minute oh, yeah. okay and then uh, let's compute this one 0 0.2 divided by 1000 that would be equivalent to uh, 0 0.2 times 1000 equals um, again um, let's uh, cancel the zero here so two, uh, two point k okay. and let's cancel down one so two times 100 is 200 so that would be 200 micrograms right 200 micrograms we're going to cancel that one microgram to microgram and then what else we start uh, computing right so we're done computing 198 divided by 2.2 so we what we have is 90 and um, what we have is 90 and uh, 60 so uh, this is what we're going to do 90 and 60 right um we're going to take out all the zeros but first we're just going to divide uh, we're going to multiply this three first 0.5 times 90 equals what 450 or 45 right 45 so uh, 45 times 60 right um, let's just take out zero here cancel the zero there okay so 45 times is 6 okay 5 times is 6 is what 30 6 times is 4 is what 6 times is 4 is 24 27 cancel the zero so the zero there and then uh, what do we have So 27 divided by 2 is 13.5. So uh, what do we have left? Uh, mLs per hour. So 13.5 mLs per hour. So we're going to run our mill renown that is 0 0.5 mics per kilogram per minute. The patient's weight is 98 pounds. CCs per hour will be 13.5 mLs per hour.